Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate, The Black Pits, with me, Bring It Don, and our band of bad boys. You need me at once. It took you long enough, you pathetic pack of peripatetics. Are you ready for your very first battle in my arena? I have a crowd waiting, and I want to show them a rousing rumble. You yeah, step into the arena with us, Baloth. We'll strike you down and win our freedom. What's the point of that? If I were to die, who would look after my guests? Who would oversee Najim? Who would summon more combatants for the arena? <laughs> really now, you're just being ridiculous. Are you ready to hear what you'll be battling against? Uh, yeah, we're, we're ready. Uh, you can pre-buff, I think, as well. Which I don't really need to worry about right now, but... Maybe in, for the future fights. Now then. Are you ready to hear what fearsome foes will fight for? Before any of our unwilling warriors wastes our time in a meaningful match, we like to warm them up with a little light exercise. So as not to overwhelm the newcomers, we'll start with the worst of a wretched lot of gibberlings. And again, my paladin outclasses literally everybody else. Um, Get over here! How may I be of assistance? I don't think I'm even going to try and micromanage the fight. There's another one of them. I'll take care of it themselves. Yeah. Kind of easy. Well, that certainly could have gone worse. You've proven you can stamp out the weakest of opponents. Now let's see how you do against some who have eaten in the last 10 days. <laughs> Ah, you have returned! Are you ready to spill blood on the arena floor? Uh, I need more time to prepare because everyone leveled up. Also, I can't zoom in. Don't know what's going on with that. Yes, All right, we still don't need to buy anything yet. Uh, money is a commodity in this uh, campaign. Ah, you have returned. Are you ready to spill blood on the arena floor? So, if you're gonna have a full party, uh, you really have to pick and choose what you're gonna buy. And I don't think the next tier of weapons even unlocks until the next tier of fights. Which, again, I think it's every three fights. It might be every five. I don't know if there's five or three tiers. But I'm pretty sure there's only fifteen fights. They may not look like much, but these gibberlings have passed inspection. Unlike that last sorry game, you'll have to break a sweat to slay these savages. What could I do to help? What is this time? It shall be as you wish. Oh, we took our first hit. I'm also pretty sure he doesn't have any well armor done, on. My precious pugilists. You've certainly proven that I picked well when I picked you to perish in the black pits. This might only end up being like a two episode series. We're, we're gonna blow through most of these fights. You need me? What would you have me do? I'd have you level up. Hmm. 
Yes. Can he learn? No. Huh? I only care about haste, which again we don't need right now. So let's just go uh, and continue. Ah, you have returned. Are you ready to spill blood on the arena floor? Prepare yourselves, my underdog gladiators. A gruesome fate awaits you at the hand of this motley mob of miscreants. I yank them from a shabby saloon. Perhaps the victors can celebrate with a drink. We're fighting cowboys, everybody. Yes, I'm here to help. Alright, they're not cowboys, what but can I do to help? they could have been. How may I be of assistance? For Let's give him a me. light thrashing. <laughs> yes. Hurry up. Yeah, I do have bless I can cast. What is it this time? Oh, I took a hit. Would that guy roll to hit me? From Erasmus, did he cast Magic Missile? Yeah, okay. What could I do to help? Time for a bit of the roof and tumble. You need me? Let's Force give them a right thrashing. What would you have me do? Yes. Alright. Well, that was easy. Congratulations! You have slain a bunch of boozy bumblers. The regime shall ensure that you are rewarded appropriately. Alright. At once. All right, so I don't think that they've upgraded their stock, but I'll double check. So I think that was the first tier of fighters. No, it doesn't look like their stock has been upgraded. Let's just double check. Yeah, so I think it's after the fifth fight. Yes, at the uh, stock upgrades. And we start getting like plus one weapons and stuff. Ah, you have returned. Are you ready to spill blood on the arena floor? I and mean, you go back and you can refight. Uh, old fights if you want to for more experience and gold. I think in the Black Pits 2 you don't get experience anymore but you do still get more gold. So I guess gold isn't really a problem in the Black Pits. I forgot you could go back and uh, refight. Uh, but I'm ready for the next challenge. Behold! Your next adversaries are a pack of punchy hobgoblins I picked up near Waterdeep. I promised them freedom if they perforate you, so they're just itching for a chance to escape. Either that or my delousing spell needs work. What could I do to help? Your wish? How may I be of assistance? Mm -hmm. Hurry up! You need me? What would you have me do? What is it this time? Your wish? Oh, no. Get out my wish. That's why I keeps turning off. Hurry up! Very well. 
I don't know who's casting lightning, but that wasn't a good idea. Yes. Oh, no. oh, what, what can I do to help? Get over here. Oh, I'm actually taking a fair bit of damage. What would you have to do? Get back here! Oh, no. Goodness. The look on their faces when they realized they would never again see those disgusting dens they call home. I think that deserves a bonus. Like we're making we're making really good time. I would actually we might be able to just beat it this episode. Wouldn't that be something? Ooh, 10 additional hit points. Congratulations, buddy. 15 additional hit points. 10 additional hit points. <laughs> ah, you have returned! Are you ready to spill blood on the arena floor? Actually, hold on. He should be able to learn some new spells, right? Or memorize more spells, I guess. I guess chant, chant is always good, and um, I'll grab him flame blade in case he ever ends up in melee. He can use that. I guess drop on holy might. Actually, I'm thinking about it. I don't know if I actually needed to bring a cleric with us in this. Uh, This expansion. Yes. At once. Ah, you have returned. Because he's uh. Oh yeah, I've been talking to the beholder. Whoopsies. It. It'll be fine. I do enjoy toying with lesser spellcasters. I captured this insolent little necromancer running for his life outside of Menzoberranza. How we got there, I don't know. But he does summon skeletons with supernatural speed. Yeah, so he said Menzo Baranzin, which is probably how you're supposed to pronounce it, but I like giving it a little country twang. I say Menzo Baranzan. I think he gives the drowls more of a redneck vibe. Which is always appreciated. What can I do to help? Hurry up! I shall attend to it in a truck. What is it this time? Yes? You have got to ask. Did I have line of sight? There we go. You need me? There we go. Got him. Uncanny! You seem to have a knack for killing things that are already dead. If only you displayed a little more flair and enthusiasm for your work. I'm pretty enthusiastic about it. I like to get the job done. There's an argument to be made for your enthusiasm. If you get it done quickly. How may I be of assistance? Well, you can level up for me. How about that? Yes. And <laughs> let's see if there's new stuff. I'm gonna give the Bard what Magic can I Missile. Do to help? Uh, who sells? At once. Let's 
So I might grab Grease as well. And Mirror Image if I can find it. I don't know what's going on with my mouse sensitivity. It's been off for the past few days. Yeah, I'm not buying it again. There we go. How may I be of assistance? You need me? At once. What magic missiles like to interrupt their spellcasters? Ah, returned! Are you ready to spill blood on the arena floor? Yeah, I'm ready for your next challenge. I think Grease would also be good for their spellcasters as well. While the spell is mightier than the sword, something is lost during a subtle spell duel. What is that elusive quality? The visceral impact of body blows, the crunch of bone, and the rending of flesh. Behold, a team of pulverizing pugilists ready to pound the precious life out of our proud defenders. <laughs> All right, let's go and drop on Holy Might for that guy. Yes. Oh, do I not get it? Never mind. What can I do to help? Spit it out. Yes. A simple task. I can go this way to intercept these guys. While everyone else goes over here to cut down those guys. What would you have me do? You rang. You need me? Oh yeah, uh... Yes. Go on then. Yes. Hang in there, buddy. What could I do to help? For justice! Hurry up! If you insist... You rang. You need me? What now, I wonder? Huh? I could use a little patch. The hero up. is on the job. You could, couldn't you? Here you go. It's already done. If what would you have me do? I could use a little patching up. It is a job for me. To know. A simple task. Enthusiastic, you need me? Yes. Actually, hold on, let's do it this way. What now, I wonder? Your wish? Yes. There we go. Well, you may be able to take a hit, but you certainly won't make one fighting such dull brutes. I must provide a more engaging foe for our next fracas. All right, can't get too cocky. What could I do to help? Hurry up! Two additional hit points, fantastic. I'm gonna grab Zone of Sweet Air because I hate the uh We'll get to spell magic later. Cause I hate
uh, the you cloud spells. Alright, let's see if we have a new tier of weapon. Or the next tier of weapons unlocked. That's still a no. Huh. Okay. We still see about getting armor for the uh, couple of guys that don't have armor, because they are going down pretty quick. So they just two sets, right? Oh, we can afford the gift of peace. That'd be really good. Should be all set. Ha! Ah, you have returned! Are you ready to spill blood on the arena floor? Yep, I am ready for your next challenge. You've beaten my hobgoblins, which means you're exceptionally strong. You've also bested my pet spellcast which means that you've studied well. I can clearly not rely on one extreme or another. So instead, I shall crush you with a combination of combatants. Carry on! Yes! How may I be of assistance? What would you have me do? What is it this time? if we can keep this guy alive. Alright, fine. What could I do to help? Time for a bit of and tumble. Our back line is supremely squishy, so if they do get into the back line, they're going to be in trouble. Inconceivable! Get out of here and take your reward with you. Though, our cleric also doesn't have armor. If have armor, he should be okay. Ridiculous! Outstanding! Impossible! Fantastic! <laughs> You've managed to crush everything I've thrown at you. Clearly, I have excellent taste in selecting gladiators. You've survived for longer than I expected and gained quite a following in the process. But don't worry, you'll be dead soon enough. I've dug out some of my rarer beasts. Very soon now, they'll crack your skull open and feast on the gooey innards. But we've served our purpose. Your guests are entertained. Let us return home and you can find new combatants. Oh, don't be such a preposterously petulant persnicket. I'll tell you what. 
Because you've been so gracious about all this kidnapping and forced to fight to the death business, I'll give you a reward. Now go get ready for your next battle. You'll most likely be slain, so it's probably time to perform whatever funeral rituals your culture requires. You need me? Impressive, mortal. Your feats in the arena have become a frequent topic of conversation. Perhaps you will set a new record for longest surviving combatant. Is there nothing you can do to help us escape? No. Baloff has tasked me with giving you this reward for your outstanding performance. Take it and prepare for your next battle. Well, hey, we got a handful of level ups. Ooh, 12 hit points. 16 hit points. Seven, that's disappointing. Hey, but six. All right, so he How should be able to learn haste now, right? Maybe not. Huh? Actually, I'm I'm pretty sure haste is a level three spell. It might be a level two spell. Watch yourself. With every battle, you anger Baloth more and more. Soon, he will pitch you against an unbeatable foe. Uh, perhaps if I beat enough of his monsters, he'll become angry enough to face me himself. No, that will never happen. It mustn't. If any of us gets to fight that hateful draw, it must be me. All right, need scrolls. I need haste. What is it this time? It's time for you to memorize a spell. Yeah, it is a level 3 spell. That's what I thought. Yes. <laughs> You've lasted longer than anyone expected. I'd start taking bets. If anyone nearby were man enough to speak to me... Are you and Brendok having a spat? A spat? Is that what he calls it? Then why doesn't he say so to my face? Uh, I just assumed. Ever since that accursed drow captured us, Brendak hasn't said a word to me. He speaks to anyone else, just not his own wife. Uh, you do have a bit of a temper, you know. Temper? I'll show you who has a temper! Listen, do you want to buy some weapons or not? Uh, yes. Please show me what you've got, ma'am. <laughs> Alright, so yes. Plus ones. Uh, we're gonna grab a couple of these for our du dual wielder, as well as a couple of those. So that's all of our damage taken care of. Make sure I have the right ones equipped. What could I do? You need me? Your prowess in battle has become well known. Perhaps it was my weapons that tipped the balance in your favor. Perhaps. And perhaps you could fashion a blade that would cut Baloth down. To cut down Baloth? Don't talk like that. He'll hear you. Besides, under the effects of his gaze, you could never use it against him. I'm not so sure about that. And everyone here is under a Aegeus. The only ones not controlled by his gaze are his friends and allies. Every bit as powerful as he is. He's too clever to fall for that. I've never seen anyone make him lose his cool. Now, are Oops. you here to buy some weapons or talk my ear off? What'll it be? Both? Huh? I'm here to help. You, you're, you're still alive. How? B B Baloth surely would have destroyed you by now. Or, or p perhaps he is merely t toying with you. Uh, maybe I'm the one toying with him. Maybe you should think about that and tell me what... It what you know of his weaknesses. But, 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 but you wouldn't torment me as he has, w would you? N no, I don't dare cross him again. 
His sav 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 savagery knows no, knows no bounds. Please, hurry and, and take what you, you, you need before he sees us talking. Yeah, why would he care that you're talking to me? It's m m not you. It's m m me. Bailoff has a, a special place in his b black heart for torturing me. He, g g he gladly takes any excuse to place me in the, 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 the pain room. Alright, man up, Devlin. Or elf up, or whatever it is you do. Don't be such a coward. B -b please, just t -t tell me what you need and g -g -g go. What a pathetic sight you are. Alright, what do you got? Longbow, other stuff I don't care about. Uh, we'll hold off on buying the bullets for right now. I'll go ahead and buy the sling, though. I uh, will be doing another fight this episode. We're just going to go ahead and talk to everybody and uh, yes. <laughs> change our equipment. You've made quite a splash in the arena, and I'm not even talking about the blood. Uh, what's wrong between you and Magda? Are you seeing someone else? Of course not. I love Magda. It's just... I don't want anything to happen to any of us. Belos torments us all, and he knows how much I love my wife. Has he forbidden you from speaking to her? I've already said too much. I'm supposed to sell you armor. Do you want any? So he's avoiding his wife so that Baloth doesn't have incentive to mess with them. I think that's, I think that's pretty... Pretty obvious. Get some armor for our back line. Yes? What could I do to help? How may I be of assistance? You need me? At once. Ah, the ones who have stymied Baylot. He says he wants a good fight, yeah, but he really wants good death. The so longer you deny him yours, the more he will pit you against deadlier foes. Uh, didn't your people fight against him first? We Durger tried to fight him. But his spells were too powerful for us to resist. Funny. Not everyone was at that battle. I still wonder what became of Thardek just before and during the battle. He returned only when it was over. And Belos had already placed me here to serve his gladiators. Uh, do you know how we could take the fight to Beloth? Perhaps you could force his hand by depleting his supply of minions. But he continually brings in more and more exotic creatures. Alright, well I need equipment. What do you have for sale? Oh, Valorant's plate. Another gift of peace. Sure. Ah, oh, yeah, we'll grab the uh, unique stuff. <laughs> Gonna equip that on my main character. Yes, at once. Oh, yeah, we need to get armor for our uh, cleric. Oh, he sells a whole bunch of Valorant's plate. Interesting. What could I do at once? So... You have not yet been eviscerated. You may allay my disappointment by buying more of my fine clothing. What's your problem with me? Your scent is even more offensive than usual for a mortal. And you show me no deference. Were I not Baylot's guest, I would tear out your innards with my bare claws. 
The singular virtue of your kind is the way you scream and writhe while being torn limb from limb. And how exactly did you come to know that? Oh, you would be surprised at how easily one becomes carried away while appraising a mortal for alterations. Now then, shall I take your measurements for a new garment? It's really saying something that you're only the second creepiest vendor at this booth. I see you find Zithus's silence as disturbing as his appearance. He should never have defied the will of Baloth. After subduing the Illithid, Baloth drilled the Mind Flayer's telepathy right out of its brain. Ooh. The ghastly wretch can speak the common tongue well enough, but it pains the monster to be reduced to what it considers such a crude form of communication. I see now why you and Baloth are friends. Alright, what do you got? Colonel Ernst, don't really care for that. Immunity to fear and panic, don't really care for that either. We get a lot of armor class against missile attacks. Don't think I'm gonna worry about it right now. You need me? I can see you staring daggers at Bayloth. You look like you want to say something. I can't figure out whether you can't or won't speak. Alright, let's see what you got. Shield amulet. The amplifier. Don't really care for that. Alright, better go. Way to go! You've been really terrific down in the pits. Do you need some more potions? My buddy the concoctor is ready to squirt out some more. Wait a second. What do you mean squirt out some more? Haven't you noticed? The concoctor doesn't mix ingredients in flasks and cauldrons and such the way a gnome alchemist would. He takes the ingredients into his own body, where they blend in exactly the right proportions before he excretes them to make the potions you need. Uh, that's very unusual. It certainly beats working in one of those expensive and smelly labs that ordinary alchemists use. I've gotten used to the concoctor's, well, mustiness. Now, can we put some new potions in you today? Yeah, let's see what you got. I don't think there's any... I don't know if there's basilisks or not. Yes. <laughs> Way to go. You've been really terrific down in the pits. Do you need some more potions? My buddy the concoctor is ready to squirt what, uh, out some more. Uh, let's go and talk to the behemoth again. Or sorry, the uh, beholder. This isn't Final Fantasy. My bad. Oh, got a little over time. Uh, we'll just finish talking to everybody. Are you prepared to face your next match? Uh, what can I expect in the next... Sorry, what can I expect to face in the next battle? When facing superior physical strength, be sure to protect the most vulnerable members of your party. And never forget that an attack can come from any direction. You need right, me? So I'm here to help. Rogues or whatever. So, you're the current favorite. May Tamora favor thee. Until we meet in the Black Pits. You can't beguile me with polite words, Red Wizard. I know you're kind. Do you? We Red Wizards may appear similar to outsiders, but no two of us are alike. You are quick to judge based on appearance alone. Interesting. They are obviously no match for us, my mistress. Actually, you know what? <laughs> based off of appearance... Yeah. Yes, I'm here to help. No, I know you can't. 
Sometimes appearance is all it takes. Hurry up! What is it this time? What could I do to help? <laughs> what would you have me do? Actually, dispel magic wouldn't be bad to have right now. What I currently have equipped: Son of Sweet Air and Holy Smite. Let's get rid of Holy Smite and do dispel magic instead. You need me? All right. Well, I'm gonna call this episode here, and the next one will probably blow through the next tier in the Black Pits. That might be how I split up the episodes. Do one tier per episode. So it'll be three episodes, I think. How many fights did we do this episode? I think it was seven? Maybe it's seven per, so there's only two tiers? That doesn't make sense. I don't know. I don't remember it that well, but we'll figure it out. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope to see you guys in the next episode.